till I can't no more. I got the horses in the back. Horse stock is a tank. <laughs> So yeah, in this tutorial we'll be learning how to make a chatbot using IBM's Watson Assistant. So like to enable the Watson Assistant, you have to head over to IBM Cloud, make an uh, like an account or like just log in if you have one, and then you can head over to catalog, and then like go to Watson Assistant under Watson Assistant, and then you can create one by so here will be the, some plans and features and all. So I already have mine, so I don't need one. So you can do that after it's like created and like it's downloaded you can head over to the resource list and then on the services it will be like what's an assistant you click on that yeah then they are just launch what's an assistant So now you can create new one. So like add a name or something. I'm just gonna put sample tutorial assistant. So uh, we don't need description for this, but we should like turn on the enable link because then this would help us a lot to like integrate it on a WhatsApp Messenger, Facebook Messenger on an or an uh, website. Then you can just hit create. And then you have to head over to dialogue and then add dialogue skill and then create skill name anything like tutorial skill tutorial yeah and then create dialogue skill and then you click on tutorial dialogue skill so like there will be some words over here i'm pretty sure you want to understand it but then i'll give you a brief example for them like for intense, we usually use them to like as a, a chatbot is a AI or a machine learning to so like the intents are basically examples which help him understand or the chatbot understand what it is about. And then you don't really need in, in entities because like it will be around what time and all. So the main thing are intents and dialogues. So like dialogue will be the main part to add notes and all to like what should you reply with. So intents. We can add intents such as hello, greetings. Yeah. And then under greetings, so like we have made an intent called greetings and you have to add example. So uh, I would say like a must of five to six examples. So like after five to six example, the machine learning or the chatbot tries to learn by itself. Pretty cool, huh? So like just give them to five to six examples. Hi, hello. Hello. So like for my one, I'm just giving three because it's just a simple one. So like for you, it is a must. And then you can add one more such as thank yous. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you one thing that in uh, when you're creating anything using a chatbot or anything or any coding and all, you should never uh, put space because uh, the computer or anything, it doesn't understand it. So it put backslash. And then you should just do this underscore you put underscore over there yeah and for this also you can just put thank you thanks really appreciate it yeah and then you can add more such as anything like goodbyes or something so i'm just gonna put and then goodbyes like bye okay. nice meeting you yeah and then here comes the main part so like these three are done like so like you can head over to try it is the menu like and you could see so like the first thing we want to see like the chatbot response like hi hello how are you so you can just say hi and it understood that it's a greeting this is where the ai comes in so like it took the intents it found the values intent which are the examples and like it understood it's a greeting so like 
as you know the watch and strain so it will take some time so like until it's done let's go to the dialogue menu the main part so like, there's a welcome note so like every time uh, we come to a website or somewhere like a chatbot it will reply with hello how how can i help you and then under that we can add a node under it such as um, hello so like if an assistant recognizes first of all it's an intent and then what should it recognize greetings so like if it recognizes greeting we should say hi nice meeting you meeting you and then add in a one hello how you doing or something like hi yeah and then we can add another node which can be thank you such as my pleasure good uh, glad it helped now we can on so like under these we should definitely change the response variations to random so like it won't just repeat the same thing after it it will make it look more robotic or something so like it will help it more like in a flow or something and then you can add an one, another one such as goodbyes one and condition again intense goodbyes oh in this one we didn't add the condition Never forget that though. So like in this villa, thank yous and all. Goodbye, you can just say bye. Nice meeting you too. Bye, don't forget me. yeah so now i can just have to draw it and you see it's done so like manage this and then you should put hi hello so you should put hi so and you see it responded with it and then let's just play say thank you thanks and you see it recognized the intent of thank yous and it said glad it helped and in the last one you can just say bye yeah so i am um, pretty sure it helped you a lot so like if it helped you please don't forget to like share and subscribe and in the next video we're going to be using visual studio code for uh, coding ex ex experience with c sharp so okay and this was just a, like a small video to tell you more about machine learning ai and about chatbots in the next uh, playlist to this we'll make a really advanced chatbot so, okay